Oh, piss. Petra and the wind. Gabriel. Supported. Start the story. I'll download th this again. <sighs> I have this season pass so I can download all three uh, and two of them. Now, I'll start episode one. I'll fix the brightness later if you guys can't see it. Back guys, I needed to send my friend a message. <sighs> the game series adapts to the choices you make. The t story is tailored by how you play. I always like stories where the hero has no idea that they're destined for greatness. The sword of heroes this who is are take living over, their yeah. lives and assume that nothing exciting will ever happen to them. Those are the kind of heroes in this story. They started as just a bunch of friends in a treehouse, looking up to their idols who had come before them. But when disaster struck and an evil monstrosity threatened to destroy the world, those friends discovered that heroes can come from the most humble of beginnings. They traveled the world to battle that monster, facing obstacles and sacrifices every step of the way. It wasn't easy, but they had each other. And working together, they struck it down and saved everyone. Soon, they were the most famous people in the whole world. And their legend, their fame, just continued to grow as they explored. friends, plus the bravest pig in the world, took their place in history as some of the greatest heroes who ever lived. Oh. <laughs> oh, uh -huh. What part are we at? Am I being awesome? We thought it was great, Lucas. Although, 
not always technically accurate. Yeah, I mean, well, I definitely exaggerated here and there, but it was for the drama. I mean, it made us sound cool, and that's a good thing. <laughs> Your yeah, pleasure, Lucas. but it might make people think we did stuff we didn't actually do. Well, you're the writer, Lucas. I know you'll make the right call. Thank you, Jesse. I had been hoping to have it ready to read at Founding Day, but, uh, next year. I can't believe it's Founding Day already. It sneaks up on me every time. Congrats, buddy. I'm proud of you for finishing it. That took a lot of work. I'm glad you liked it. You did so much, Jesse. You're a real hero. But... We all did, right? Yeah, we were all there. Most of the pot? For uh, most of it, anyway. Hey, come on, guys. We all did it together. We're the Order of the Stone, after all. It is a good note, though. I'll keep that in mind when I'm editing. Well, this has all been really helpful feedback, guys. Once Ivor and Harper get back from their adventures, I can add a chapter about them, and then it will finally be done. Man, they've been gone a long time. I love this episode 1, 2, Jesse, 3, 4, and 5 of season 2. Jesse? Oh, hey, Radar. Oh. Okay, then. Audio display. Okay. Gosh, wow. I didn't know all of you would be in here. <laughs> Olivia, ma'am, Axel, sir, you, Lucas, sir. So sorry to interrupt everyone. Oh, he is just adorable. My deepest, sincerest, ugly. Hang on. I'll be right. If I've caused any inconvenience. Radar, don't be so formal. Cut it out with all the sir and ma'am stuff. The music would make it look sound better. Right, oh, right. Awesome. I kind of like it. So, what's up? I got a message from Petra that she's on her way to the mines. For that adventure you scheduled, if you hurry. <laughs> You should still have time for that and your founding day duties. Oh, nice. going yeah you should yeah uh about that we've actually got our own founding day stuff we need to prep for yeah i need to get back to boomtown i'm judging a tnt rally in the morning oh that's okay, okay. i get it you have your life and so do i ah <sighs> thanks jesse yeah thanks petra will never let you hear the end of it though tell petra i said next, next time for sure show. okay I, I love can't this wait thing. to see how that sword of hers is coming along. Yeah, I'll tell her.
I believe I'm walking out of the order hall with what the you order. <laughs> Shut up. So freaking cute. So the other towns have founding day celebrations, huh? Yeah, man. We honor Magnus every year with a freaking awesome memorial explosion rally. He would have loved it. Over in Redstonia, we're a little lighter on the explosions. I helped Eligard engineer an excellent new music machine for the evening ball. Well, I promise I will try and stop by. It was awesome to catch up with you guys. Yeah, God. This... Five, or three, and two. <sighs> Let's go. Yeah, this has been great. Uh, won't be the same without you guys. Ah, buddy, you're gonna make me sad. Thanks again, guys. I'll let you know as soon as I'm done with the revisions. Oh, cool. Okay. Can't wait. Axel. I tell ya, I am just the luckiest. Yeah? Oh, yeah. Getting to work with you, hanging out with the Order, and Kay. living in the coolest town in the whole world. Beacon Town. <laughs> Be right back. I'll play some above my own music. Holy crud. I hate it when they don't allow you to play music in the live stream. adventuring with your friends but I'm really glad you're our leader you just make this place awesome yeah I just wish I could have hung out with my friends more we're all so busy now that is hard but at least they come back to visit a bunch that's pretty awesome I know that Petra is waiting for you in the mines but I bet people would really appreciate you helping set up for the celebration I'll keep that in mind when gates of beacon temp Beacon. It's powered by the Nether Star the Witherstorm dropped. 
Oh, I know! Even before I moved to Beacon Town, I came on a trip to see the Beacon. I love this thing. Who's starting with uh, a Minecraft or remote texture pack instead of a skin pack? Because the water looks good. You would actually b buy it. Simpler times. Jesse, dude! Nell. Nell, I thought you were out seeing the world. Did that? Righteous times. Thought I'd try settling down for a while, though. Like, I love danger and daring do as much as the next person. But sometimes you just want to have a place to store your junk. Okay. So you're glad you're well, I'm home, so glad you're here. Man, that is just the sort of warm welcome I had hoped. You rock, Jesse, dude. Between you and me, I am worried that I won't like fit here. So many rad builds, awesome people. I really want to make like a good first impression, you know? Which we'll make another word like this. might be helped if my front yard had a statue by the one and only Jesse. Not sure if I have time, but I'll see what I can do. Hey, hey, hey! This is going to be so cool! Scoop up that clay over there and let's get to business! Episode 5 uh, will take a long yes. time. I'm not that used to is it. Some sweet work. Nice. Oh, Jesse, dude, thanks. It was my pleasure. Well, it is an honor, mi amigo. And don't be a stranger, okay? Well, she is a fascinating woman, isn't she? Very free spirited. <laughs> yeah. Kind of reminds me of Petra back in her early days. Speaking of whom, you said she's waiting for me at the. Mineshaft. Mm hmm. Okay. Whoa! Oh, Wink! Get back here! Leave Jesse alone! Hello there, Jesse! I was wondering when we'd run into each other. Thought we'd give this town of yours a try. It's quite lovely. Yeah, and I can't believe how many people are here. Well, it's so great to see you. We need to hang out. That sounds wonderful. Okay. Yeah, totally. Radar, this is Stacy Plays and Stampy Cat. Oh, Wink. Here, Jesse, give him a bone and he'll calm right down. Here, Wink. Nice, tasty bone. Aw, see? He likes you. Ha, <laughs> yeah. You want the rest of these back? Nah, hang on to them. I've got tons. You never know when you're gonna need to tame a wolf. Well, thanks. I imagine you're terribly busy, so we won't keep you. But you should come and see what we're working on because it's pretty cool. Yeah, what Stampy said. Anyway, our place is by Love the gate. Game. Will do. See you guys later. I'll work on other games. Witherstorm, before all that stuff. Is it true? You have got to tell me more about it. I can barely even picture it. I have devoured everything Lucas has written about you guys in those days. <laughs> All right. I love talking about the good old days. Yes. Was there a deeper meaning? Oh, or like a critique of the world, maybe? I draw my inspiration from my friends. We were a team. It was a group effort. Oh, classic Jesse. I love that. The build I really wish I got to see was what you built to take down the wither storm. Now that must have been terrifying. The world coming apart at the seams. Tentacles everywhere. Well, it's like I said about drawing inspiration from my friends. We all gave each other strength during that fight. Amazing. I hope I have friends like that someday. Oh, you are just the best. Oh, and thank you so much for taking the time to stop and talk to me. Oh, not a problem. I'll see you around, all right? Yeah. Ruben's memorial. Best pig that ever lived. I miss you, buddy. Oh, man. I wish I could have met Ruben. 
He sounded amazing. I read Lucas's book oh, the other day. That chapter about Reuben almost got me crying he... right there. Yeah, he was my best friend. This is gonna take away. Still miss him. Aww. Oh my gosh, it's you! Oh, yep, it's me. What are What are you doing here? Oh wow, this is actually perfect. For founding day this year, we're picking a pig to play the part of Reuben on the float. Oh, that's really cute. Right? Uh, would you be interested in maybe helping me pick? I mean, who knows Reuben better than Jesse, right? I would love to. It seems like the least I could do. Oh, that's fantastic. Thank you so much. All right, let's see him. Okay, piggies. Show Jesse your good side. <laughs> That's Esteban, smushy cute cheeks, and Lord Von Thunderpork the Sixth. <laughs> Tried my best to bring the pigs that felt the most Reuben-esque. Hmm? My vote is for Lord Von Thunderpork the Sixth, no question. I mean, look at that regal little guy. Really? Ah, I knew that's who you'd choose. Fantastic. Congratulations. <clears throat> Thank you, Jesse. I'm going to get him ready, and I'll see you at the celebration. Bye! Okay, so... Get the sugar cane. Sugar, nice! Um, talk to the citizen. Jesse! Oh, hey, hey! Look who it is! Jesse! Hey! Hey, guys, what are you doing? Glad you asked. We're working on a new game for founding day that I guarantee you Slime is all think? the rage this year. Slime diving. <gasps> Want to give us a hand finishing it up? I'll let you take the first dive. Bob designed the schematics, didn't you, Bob? That sounds awesome. Let's do it. We're going to be diving off this excellent pagoda Bob designed, but we can't decide what material to use. Stone is safe. What? I'm just conflicted. Because stone is safer. Why don't we run with that? Nice. That turned out great. And just like I promised. You can take the first dive. Okay, use this favorite Just aim move. for the slime. It'll be great. Double twist. <laughs> Woo! Ta-da! Thanks, everyone. Jesse, that was incredible. Seriously, amazing dive. Thank you for that. Thank you for the help before. No problem. Look, my friend's waiting. So <laughs> okay. Nice work. Talk to the citizen. What you looking at, citizen? Jesse! Wow! Hi! Huh. Uh, just checking out my latest build from the ground. I'm worried it doesn't, you know, uh, fit. Is it putting the right energy into the universe? Doesn't fit. I think it's perfect. Perfect. Oh, wow! Uh, maybe I'm overthinking this. Yeah, I love it. This just gives me even more to think about. Uh, okay then. We'll just leave you to it. Is he okay? No, I don't think so. Excuse me, ma'am. Thank you. Huh. What a lovely garden. Stampy, it needs to be pumpkin pie. But cake is the best, and I would know. I have it every yeah, morning. Yeah, remember. Is there some sort of problem here, guys? Hello, Jesse. We heard about this founding day celebration of yours, and we thought we'd make some sweets. 
Yeah, and now I'm trying to convince Mr. Stampy here to make the right decision and pick pumpkin pie. There you go with those leading presentations again. Just, not everyone likes cake, Stampy. Oh, I do love me some pumpkin pie. Ha! See, Stampy? Told you. Oh, yes, yes, fine. You really showed me. Cake is still better. Here, you should just take the ingredients Holy and crud. decide for us. Yes, I feel we're going to be debating in circles all day otherwise. <laughs> you know, there might be some extra eggs and stuff around town. They picked them I up. bet you could find enough to do cake and pie. Uh, I don't have a ton of time. Look at a surprise, though. Yeah, they'd be super surprised by that. Okay, so... Okay, cake get high. He said cake, she said pie, then I said, why don't we just have both? Oh, well, this is very surprising. Yeah, that's awesome. How did you do that? Eh, found some extra ingredients around town. No big deal. Well, that's fantastic, Jesse. Thank you so much. Yeah, thanks. This is perfect. Yeah, Look, I gotta run. Petra's waiting. I'll talk to you guys later, okay? Okay, let's go. Bye! Now, let's go. And here we are at the mines. Nice. Thanks for walking with me. Oh, no. Thank you, Jesse. It was a pleasure watching you work. It truly was. Stopping to help all those people. Helping them prepare for founding day. Very inspiring. I'll, uh, keep watch on things here while you're gone. Off doing your adventure things. Don't Escape disappoint me. You better. Don't disappoint me, Radar. I... I hadn't even thought about that being a possibility till just this moment. Bye! Have a good time! Don't I always? <sighs> Let's go. Petra? Huh, I swear she said to meet right here. Sort out. Zombie Cummings. Where are you? No! Oh, stupid zombie. Oh, I missed this. <laughs> oh, smell not so much. Well, you're late, but at least you still remember how to fight. Oh, hey. Hey, I was worried you'd gotten rusty. 
I can't even imagine that life. Whoa, whoa, I am not going to stay. <laughs> oh yeah? Says the scrub wearing iron armor. I didn't want to dent the good stuff, so what? And look who's talking with an iron sword. Where's your fancy gold one with all the enchantments? Can't remember the last time I saw you without it. I, uh... <laughs> time to find out just how rusty you are. <laughs> This. <laughs> Too slow, zombies. Typical. <laughs> Not just in our mind. my step yet. Well, you sure showed me. Glad you finally made it. Sometimes I worry you don't even have time for me... ...your friends anymore. I mean, I get that you like your job and everything, but jeez. And it's not just you being late. Can't help but notice that we're missing... ...one, two, three... Axel has boomtown duties, Olivia's grading something or other in Redstonia, and Lucas... ...is writing, I figured. Man, our friends have gotten lame. I swear, if our old fans saw what we're doing now, I'm just saying, I don't care how good Lucas's next book is, it's not exactly slaying a wither storm, you know? You're right. It is lame. It just isn't the same without them. See, I knew you'd get it. We'll worry about them later, I guess. We gotta hurry. What exactly are we looking for down here? Oh... Tell you when we find Just um, trust me, it's important. Gonna turn water for a minute. Do -do. What was that? Come on, let's race! Wait, what? It's monster hunting time! Ugh. Hey, it's Jesse! What's up? Good to see oh, you. Perfect. I'm starving. <laughs> hey, I was gonna eat that. Obviously. Obviously. Everyone get down! It's gonna blow! I've got skill. Down huh. there. Woo! Alright, where'd you go? Where'd what go? <laughs> So you're really not going to tell me what we're chasing? Nope. Mystery is what makes it fun. Come on. Go run. Back up. Ha! Ah, take that! And that! Yeah. Mm. My turn to save you, Petra. Take forever 
to get through these stupid web heads. Maybe we can seal them off somehow? <laughs> the lava Wait, can... Maybe a little lava. Why not? Totally did the trick. Ah, see ya. Hey, no fair. Oh yeah! In your face! Say too much. Petra! Petra! You're number one! You're number one! Uh, cheater, much? I totally saved you back there. Don't oh. gloat. Oh, yeah. You're right. Sorry. I shouldn't be gloating. I was just excited. Okay, this mystery better live up to all the hype. Here I come, mystery monster. Okay, let's go. I'll upload this stream after I'm done with episode one. A llama? A llama? Awesome! We found it! Oh, your owner is gonna be so happy to see you. Wait, let me get this straight. This quest was just to track down a stupid llama? <laughs> It's not just a stupid llama. It's, uh, it's important, okay? It's apparently like, a uh, treasure sniffing llama, or, uh, it's important, okay? Please, just trust me. We just need to bring her back to her owner. It doesn't need to be like a thing. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. If you say it's important, then I trust you. Yeah? Yeah. Now, how about we get you out of here, huh? He's still oh, ugly. Big, ugly llama thing. Just hold still so we can get this over with. Ah. <laughs> That's what you get for wearing that dork armor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll just have to craft a new set. Don't let it get away! I lack vortex. Just grab them! Oh, gross! Come on, let's get after that armor wrecking thing. Uh, hang on, it's super dark down there. We should make a torch. Okay, let's go. Here, llama, llama, llama. Where'd you go? After you, Mayor Jesse. Mayor Jesse. You, I'm not the mayor. I'm the here in residence. Leader and hero in residence. I know, I know. It's just that you do a lot of paperwork and like. Town running things. How the heck did you get up there? Who knows, but it's coming down now. way to find out what was that creepy whisper uh, I didn't hear anything the slayer of the 
Some sort of glove or gauntlet? Looks like it's made out of prismarine. A prismarine? But you only find that at the bottom of the ocean. The old builder's downfall. This world champion. This world. My TST row. The most the world the and all the land. Just Whoa! How did? Where? How did that did come? thing I don't know I, I don't know it, it, it seems like it's not hurting you and that's good let's it see it looks kind of okay actually it looks really cool it's not hurting me but it keeps making these weird whispers I haven't heard anything well uh, here I'll help you take it off <laughs> Ow. Okay. Ow. Wow. Stop. That thing is really stuck. I just can't shake this feeling that maybe you were meant to find that gauntlet. Like, maybe it was your destiny or something. Why is it all just me? Yeah, the odds? Command blocks, blocks portal, portal keys. keys. Why, Why is it always is it me? me? There's I don't a know, pattern. But there's definitely a pattern. Uh oh! Get off the pyramid, quick! Bottomless. Yep. Wow. That is bottomless. Well, we can't just leave something like this exposed. We we should cover it up. Yeah. Agreed. Okay, let's go. What is that? Not sure, but I'm getting a Sex bad feeling blood. that it's the actual way we're going to fix this. On second thought, let's talk about it anywhere but here. Not getting out the way we came, though. Look above here. There, come on. Maneuver 61. Like it? Be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. Just needed to send him a message. Oh, 
so close to Beacon Town. You could leave a warning or something. Nothing to see here. Top secret. Go away. Keep up the grass. Warning. Heck, mouth. Straight to the point. I like it. Okay, then. <clears throat> what do we do about all this? Well, it's all made of prismarine, right? And you only find that in, like, monuments and stuff at the bottom of the ocean. There's Jack. a treasure hunter in Beacontown named Jack. Kind of a legend. He knows everything about prismarine, exploring the ocean. Because we definitely can't have that happening again. That was... That was really bad. I know you're giving me that look you give me when you think I'm crazy, but I swear, I think this guy's our best shot at solving this prismarine problem. And I'll take you to Jack's shop as soon as I'm back. But first, I really need to deal with this llama. Okay, come on, you. We have to do something about that, that heck mouth. Well, we already did. It's totally sealed up. You did the sign. Can't we talk about this after I bring her back? Why is that llama so important to you? <sighs> you know my sword? Gold one, with all the enchantments. Miss Butter? Miss Butter? Yeah, I, I kinda got tricked by this person named Stella. Said she just wanted to put it on display for a little while. And now she won't give it back until I do dumb quests like this for her. <clears throat> it's, uh... Well, no, humiliating. Wow, can't believe you're getting pushed around like that. That's kind of humiliating. Yeah, I know. So yeah, her her name's Stella, and she's kind of obsessed with treasure. She says this is her treasure sniffing llama. Her she runs a place called Champion City. Wait, like Champion City, right over there? I had no idea that a leader was like that. Yeah, she's ambitious. And she's willing to do anything to get her way. Bullying, lying, cheating. Without my sword, I just really need to get it back. Just hope Stella actually gives it back this time. I can smell a bully from a mile away, Petra, and I don't let bullies go being smelled on my watch. <laughs> You're one of the good ones, Jesse. Thanks. Come on. Can't wait to meet this Stella myself. Yeah. Okay. Let's do it. Then, freshly rearmed, we'll come back, sort out that heck mouth, and get this thing off my hand! Oh, Champion City stocks. City. Every single one of those apartments up there is exactly the same. Stella is strict about how things look here. She claims the top level are the diamond class apartments, but they're just one block wider. Mm, I don't know yeah. if this is quite my taste. I prefer what we're doing in Beacon Town. Yeah, Stella always wants everything exactly her way. Doesn't matter how other people want to build. That's why I like Beacon Town better too. What? Come on, we're almost there. It's like she doesn't want to go see Stella. I kind of know how she feels. I just really need this to go well. And with Stella, well, it doesn't most times. Hey, that's why you've got me, remember? We're a team. We will take care of this no problem. Sure hope you're right. Anyway, Stella usually has her office hours in the center of the courtyard. Well, I hope she's ready for an appointment with Jesse and Petra. Let's mash down the door. Ugh. 
Where's Stella? Yes, that's right. Puppies for everyone. No shoving now. We're not beacon towners. <laughs> no shoving. No, no, no. You've probably put this together right now, but Stella's pretty fond of herself. I would play to her ego. Ah, oh, well, that is a cute one. And he could be all yours. Provided you have the right payment, of course. Oh, she matches. I'm gonna delete a. Okay. Hey, you. Oh, Luna, my darling, you came home. You came back. Uh, Rodrigo, could you bring Luna home, please? There's a good girl. Stella. Oh, look who it is. Jesse, leader of Beacon Town, and my sworn rival. I've never met her before, right? No. Our rivalry, Beacon Town versus Champion City. Surely you think about it as much as I do? <laughs> Sorry, but you are not my rival. Even my B list villains are way scarier than you. I do not know what kind of mind games you are trying to bring into our rivalry, but I'll tell you right now, they are not going to work on me. Aiden. Um, maybe I thought I was in a deer again. I love the glove, by the way. Absolutely, darling. You wouldn't be interested in trading, would you? Got some fine puppies here. <laughs> Let's trade ever. Of course. Just a puppy for this? That's a terrible trade. Rude. I just thought I'd offer. I heard you need a new pet. Okay, hold it. Oh, Petra, you're here too. I almost thought Luna just came back on her own. What do I owe you? A puppy? No, that wasn't... A diamond, maybe? No, I... Stop talking already? Voice is exhausting me. Sword. I want sword. My sword. Preposterous. I was very clear. I make trades for treasures. I think I'm all done here. You said you just wanted to display it. I thought I could still use it. <laughs> oh, no, honey. No. <laughs> You wanted to become my champion. You came to me, remember? In exchange, you got to live here instead of Beacon Town. Isn't that nice? We'll oh, talk about no, that. Was that supposed to be a secret? <laughs> oh dear, Petra, sweetie. Let's do this. I. Uh, well, Long story. I think it's about time I go back to my treasure hall, Jesse. By the way, way nicer than yours. Okay, my treasure room looks like cooler. You take stuff up people. Did you know the way out? Of oh, what am I saying? Of course Petra does. If you ever want to play in Champion City, just ask. <laughs> I could just take... Like I said, she's the worst. She's a pain. I'm not letting her get away with this. We're getting even. Hey, I'll just settle for getting my sword back. I just don't know how we're going to do that. Oh, this is Stella's easy. Stella's treasure room is right there. Uh, but I've got a bad feeling about those bodyguards of hers. Could probably sneak in through the puppy kennel, but that's a lot of barking puppies. There's got to be a way. We'll roll in, fight the bodyguard, snag the sword, get out again. Piece of cake. I like the sound of that. Why not? Hey, you can't be in here, and you definitely can't have those. Let's get fire it up. I don't love don't fire it up, Teruddy. <laughs> don't fire up yours either. We still really need to talk about this, Petra. You really want to discuss it now? Yes, I do. It does seem like weird timing. Get out. Shush. Hey, 
just you! I'm trying to have a conversation here! Did you just lock on swords and then try the conversation? <laughs> Get lost. Literally. The city thing's kind of a big deal, don't you think? Is it though? So I have a house here. So what? Hey! What's going on out here? Uh. What? I feel like you're deflecting the issue. Uh, me? Shut up. Not you. No, not you. Yipes. What about not wanting to be tied down? What about your friends? You mean the friends who are never around anymore? What did you say? No matter what happens, no matter how much I do, you're the big hero. You probably don't even remember what it's like adventuring out there, scrounging for resources. Just look at today. We were supposed to go on one adventure, and you were late. I can't even get my friends to spend time with me. Do you know how it feels to show up for quest after quest and just hearing, Oh man, I'm sorry, next time, next time. Well, what about loyalty, huh? To your friends? The people who take care of you? Doesn't that mean anything? Of course it does, dummy. But do you really, like, expect me to just hang around waiting for you forever? I've got my own life, my own stuff, too. Dot, dot, dot. This is Stella's treasure room? Yeah. Look, that looks prophetic. I will throw the road. Gold pants, sponge blocks, a diamond hoe? Yep, all bought from other people. Half of them still have the name tags of other people on them. Okay, now I'm just getting mad. Being a hero and being cool is more than just having a room full of treasure. Especially treasure you got from other people. Hey. I know one treasure she doesn't get to keep, though. We got the episodes fair and square. No! Where'd it go? Where'd she put it? You're sure it was here? <clears throat> so, our rivalry escalates again. You're not my rival! Good night, my rival! Says the person breaking into my treasure room. Classic rival move. You shouldn't be here. Well, you shouldn't be such a jerk. Guess we're all disappointed. That really. Okay, okay, fine. Just take it. Take the stupid sword. I've got better treasure than that anyway. Hope you learned a lesson here, Stella. No one cheats my friends and gets away with it. Yes, I've certainly learned how you deal with people you disagree with. Good peasants. I won't forget this, Jesse. History will remember this as an important day in our rivalry. Still not my rival. The day you will rue till... Still not my rival. Oh, man. Never happening. I never will. This is gonna take me a few minutes. Rah, feels so good to have you back. What? Oh, come on. I'm sorry, okay? I already know I don't deserve this back. Oh, I can't stay angry at you, Petra. I'm really disappointed, but I forgive you. Well, that's a relief. <laughs> What a cack mouth! <laughs> yeah, yes, yeah. What is that? Cack mouth. Stop that. Or those. Well, it's a lot of creepers. And they're <laughs> charged? That should be impossible. Tell them that. <laughs> oh, stupid cheap sword. I got you covered, Jesse. <laughs> so good to have you back. <laughs> No 
you don't! Junk! Oh, that would have been dumb if it wasn't so awesome! Oh, come on. We need to get this thing covered up again. I don't know how we're going to get this to hold. That heckmouth blew right through the ground. First your prismarine gauntlet, then that prismarine pit spitting out creepers. We need to get to Jax fast. Yeah, I hope this treasure hunter knows as much as you say he does. He does. He's gotta. Come on, I'll show you. <laughs> click, click. Bad luck. Welcome bad. to Bad Luck Alley. Wow, I d didn't even know people hung out down here at night. Well, yeah, it's the cool part. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, uh, you know, these are the people who like to live off the grid, outside the rules. And you're kind of the boss. It's just the way the world works. That's like the trade-off when you're in charge. You know that. Well, I really appreciate you showing me. I know this is like your thing or whatever, and it's nice of you to share. <laughs> You are such a cornball, but no problem. Why don't you know anything about your own Should town? Should be somewhere down here, I think. Yeah. Wait, have you never been here before? You said you knew a guy. <sighs> okay, uh, not um, know him, know him, I know of him. Let's go. Okay, fine. He's a legend, all right? He was once one of the greatest treasure hunters in the whole world. And he's kind of a hero of mine, what should I say? I'm gonna what run my I can't believe I'm about to meet Jack. But what if he invites me to go adventuring with him? I've, I've heard legends of how great he is. Hey, you're a great adventurer too, Petra. Just play it cool around him. Well, I mean, I'm no Jack, but I'll give it a shot. Good advice. Jack and Nerm's Adventure Jack Emporium. Jack and Nerm's Adventure Emporium. Found it. Yup, that's our place. Man, I've always wanted an excuse to come here. Well, the excuse is that gauntlet. <laughs> oh, wow. The Upper Lowlands, Spider Peak Mountain, the Ice Crags of Doom. This is going to be worth like it. I told you, Jack might be the best adventurer in town. This stuff is from all over the world. See, Petra? Beacon Town has some pretty cool stuff too, huh? Oh, uh, well, I mean, what's cool about all of this is that it isn't from Beacon Town, though. Uh, but you've got a good point. This is a, a big win for Beacon Town. Push the service. Jack and Nerm's Adventure Emporium. <gasps> I mean, what's up? You push the button. Very, very brave. Uh, are you sarcastic? Uh, thanks, I think. You're not being sarcastic, right? I don't make a habit of it. <sighs> Turn around, and then he disappears behind you. The warriors of the Whispering Mountain call me the Stab Walker. The Air Titans of the East call me He Who Slashes Like Thunder. But you can call but me you Jack. You call me Jack. So cool. I have.
have lots of names too. The the people of Sky City called me the the Ground Finder. Other people know me as the Wither Slayer. You can call me Jesse. Uh, Jesse. Ah, Best name. Cool names. So, what can I do for you today? So him the gauntlet. Woodland Mansion. Whoa. Start going, David. <laughs> yeah, that's what we're here about. <laughs> Well, just a drink. Oh, uh, wow, huh? Crazy glove you got there. <laughs> Not that I've ever seen one before. Uh, looks real crazy, though. Crazy we know stuff. you're lying. Jack, look at yourself. We know you're lying. Why? Yeah, uh, be straight with us, um, Daddy O. I. Okay, that is. His... Uh, Found it on top of a creepy bottomless pit, right? Spitting out monsters. Yeah, and it had a slot with like a weird symbol. Structure block. <sighs> you should have never picked up that gauntlet. It's not for us mortals to tamper with. I don't get it. What's the big deal? It's a glove. There's a hole in the ground. Oh, it's much more than that, friend. That pit. It's as deadly as they come. And that symbol you saw was the symbol of the structure block. Legend says it was a mighty tool that could grow civilizations like seeds, create cities in the blink of an eye. You need one of those to close your pit. So where can I get one of these structure blocks? Petra thought maybe an ocean monument because of the prismarine? Oh, it's an ocean monument, all right. The villagers of Mushroom Archipelago call it the Sea Temple. Mm hmm. Hey, Nurm. No, no, no problem. Guys, this is Nurm, my other half. He's the genius behind all of our fine maps. Nurm, this is Jesse and Petra. Hmm. You're doing this, though. Hi. Sup? What are you doing with your hands? I was just about to tell these two that I can't help them. What? Yes, you can. I love your early work. Witherstorm, old builders, awesome. But as a purveyor of fine maps and adventures, your death would be terrible for business. But... Sorry. I just can't. Well, then I guess Does we'll take cancer? our business elsewhere, right, Petra? Yeah, that's what we'll do. Just, just stroll right on out of here. Oh wow, Petra, please stop. I'm guessing there are tons of people who know where to find this place. <sighs> That's where you're wrong. Test memory. It's like I said before. The world's a lot bigger than you think it is, Jesse. Pistons? That's the entire map. The empty square is the sea temple. Let me guess. The empty square is where we need to go. Yep. And it's missing because... I, uh... Kind of burned it. I threw it into a volcano, okay? What? Why? You didn't need that kind of danger anyway, alright? I swore I wouldn't take anyone else to that temple ever again. I refuse to let it take any more lives. Hmm. <sighs> Shut up, Nurm. What? Oh, I see what's going on here. You're scared. No. I'm the one <laughs> the apex hunters of the Sergeo Pass call Fearless Dagger. I don't do scared. You are scared. I found a gauntlet just like that once. Teamed up with my friends Voss and Sammy to follow its trail. Neither of them made it out alive. Hence, uh, you know, lava, map, volcano, you remember what I was saying, anyway. But burning the map couldn't erase the horrible memories. 
And thanks to the curse of my perfect sense of direction, I couldn't forget the location of that temple if I tried. So, if you're the only one who knows where it is... Yep. Without me, you never get to that sea temple. Then come with. That knowledge is my curse. Hmm. Chad, I get that you're haunted by horrible memories, but that's no reason to sit around moping. And demons. What'd you say? It's time to go get us some treasure and help you face your demons. Yeah! As he said. Sounds to me like a challenge. And no one, and I mean no one, challenges the Velvet Tornado. Me. And gets away with it. Yeah? Nerm, time to get our adventuring things. Mm. Jesse, it's perfect. Structure block? Sea temple? I know, it's amazing. It's almost too good to be true. Ah, uh, yes! Oh, by the way, am I doing a good job playing it cool? Uh, think he thinks I'm cool? Get way out of I it. No, I was a little awkward at first. Petra, I'm gonna say this as your best friend and someone who cares about you very deeply. Please never play it cool again. Never? Never, ever. Ouch. Okay, fine. You did a terrible job. Derm, I told you it's not the admin. Mm -mm. Oh, How did it is? What did he say? Nothing. Villager stuff. Nurm here wants to make a new map of this place. Uh, what with the uh, whole lava volcano incident. <laughs> this is a adventure. Easy, Nurmy. Don't blow a gasket. Huh? I didn't know you villagers went on adventures. <laughs> yeah, most don't. <laughs> You know, I remember when we first met, we had, uh, well, that's another story for another day. Just explain the story. All you gotta know is there's no one else I'd rather have by my side. So that means we're off to the Sea Temple? Don't you think you're looking a little squishy for that? Seriously? I mean, you're wearing a vest. The vest of five fists? Gifted to me by the singing clerics of Port. Okay, geez, I get it. It's a cool vest. Come on, I just need to make a quick pit stop and I can show you some real armor. Don't touch that. That's what oh, you I'm so glad you're here. Hey, Radar. There is a lot going on. Jack Someone scared needs to him. finalize the ideas for the Founding Day banners. The cake baking team can't agree on what color to make the front of their shop. The Woolmakers Guild isn't super happy about their booth being next to the firework union. Understandable. The delegate from Boomtown left word that she wanted to make a speech at the parade. Very odd. Blue hair. Smells like sulfur. Speaking of which, you should probably work on your founding day keynote address. Oh, and rehearse it! Why didn't I factor in rehearsal time? Stupid, stupid! I'm sure I can shift a few things around, maybe push back your lunch with the followers of Soren. They're very strange anyway, they'll understand. Maybe. And Radar. did you know Lucas left a- ah! Sorry, got in the zone there. Uh, what's up, boss? Out. I see you brought friends and a new accessory short version the town's in danger I stopped it for now but I think this can help me fix it permanently I'll be gone for a little bit gone but Jesse what about Beacon Town founding day is right around the corner and if it's really in, in, in danger sure, who will protect everyone there's no telling what could happen and I have so few details radar I think the town will be fine for one adventure Petra and I need to do this. Okay. If you really say so. Well, um, best of luck. I'll be anxiously awaiting your return. Sure. <laughs> um, goodbye. Hey. <laughs> you said it. Can't believe that's your assistant. He's more wound up than a pack of parrots with a jukebox. Or a creeper in a herd of cats. Or a squid in a, I don't know, a box or something. Anyway, he's real nervous is what I'm saying. Yeah, he's pretty hyperactive. I wish I could get him to calm down. Maybe teach him to meditate. Like the knights of the Shuje forest. So, where's this armor of yours? Oh, Let's wow. go. You got some pretty cool stuff here. Stuff I've never... Uh, 
probably only seen, you know, once or twice. Not as cool as my stuff, obviously, but uh, you're well on your way. Definitely on your way to becoming a big hero like me. Best part is there's always another adventure on the horizon. Yeah, like a sea temple. Yeah, okay, not exactly what I meant, but sure. I love a little mansion. Are those pyramids? Hey, wait, is this not where you keep your armor anymore? Yeah, I'm not seeing any armor. No? No, I just had Olivia install a little upgrade while she was here. Oh, did they take the new equipment? Yeah, I've got one of those too. Just don't discover it. Alvar, Desember, Star Shield. Nice choice. I remember Ivor told me something about that one's hyper density and impenetrability, but it all went way over my head. Now that's more like it. Agreed. Hey, uh, can you just give me and Jesse a minute? Huh? Oh. Listen, uh, with the heck mouth and everything, I feel like I didn't get to properly apologize for all the stuff with my sword, Champion City. So, I'm sorry. You won't hear it again, so don't get used to it. I'll totally deny everything later. I appreciate it. I mean, it's pretty big of you. Hey, look, I really meant it. Ah, it really is big of me, isn't it? Okay, now with that sappy stuff out of the way, let's go find us a sea temple. Jack, Nurm, you guys ready to go? Always. So where are we going exactly? It's time to chart a course. Go to see. Shut up, Nurm. It's an awesome name. <laughs> Xbox this bar. off the cliff, mournful blade in hand, and drove it right into the head of the Ikara zombie. I slept on an enormous pile of diamonds that night. Enormous? Oh, I can only Dun. imagine. Dun. If you hear that soundtrack, oh, yeah. Pretty typical it's from day for me. Palmer's You'll system. See. After this, I'll take you to this amazing woodland mansion I found. Yeah, let's make that happen. It's really far from here. Hey, that sounds really Ooh. cool. I can't wait either. Uh, yeah, sure, of course. All right, before we go down there, I feel I should give you one last warning. The rules as you know them, how the world works, those don't always apply in this temple. Hmm. Hey, what? Some people believe it's because this temple was made by the admin. The what? <sighs> Supposedly, he's some all-powerful ancient person. Built the world, I don't know. But the legend of the admin is just that. A legend. A story. Well, that's a bunch of superstitious malarkey, frankly. I've been to the swamps of Fuja and back, and that's still one of the more ridiculous things I've ever heard. Yeah, I've seen weirder than that. True. Old builders, weather storms, computers. Well, let's just agree to disagree. I'll give you one thing, though. Admin or not, what you're going to see in this temple, it'll stay with you. Do 
Uh, we used this island as our staging area last time we were here. How can you be so sure it's the same one? Uh, perfect internal compass. The... The Sea Temple is directly below us. It's like I can feel it. Hey, uh, how exactly are we going to breathe? Knew a guy that taught me how to hold my breath for ten minutes. I mean, that's impressive, but... Picked up these enchanted helmets from the deep dwellers of Honbar Kavas. Time to suit up and roll out. That would be just creepy if they just right appeared right there. Temples that way. How Compass. Compass. Right. Oh, that's so cool. Dude, I'm busy. I'm doing my own stream. Jesus. Um. Okay, so I have to swim. There's some of those seaweed and some blacks that I don't recognize. Wow! There she is. Incredible! Okay. Guardians. We better get out of here ASAP. Sure that we have all our limbs? How about we find that structure block? Okay, so now those are the Admin's Colossus. Heard my name, uh, Romeo. Uh, I forgot they did that. The star okay, and Fred. That's not normal. Those things are creepy. If you look closely, the carvings on this prismarine aren't like anywhere else in the world. Really? Yep. Completely unique. No one's quite sure why. But you'll... <sighs> I, uh... I'm gonna need a sec. Just to check my enchantments. Yeah. Gotta make sure they're all there. Okay. Well, I'm gonna scout ahead. <sighs> What's wrong? Yeah, uh, nothing. Nothing. Must hit a patch of soul sand or something. Ooh, whoa, it's uh, got me. Like, uh, frozen in place. 
about. Good thing you're better at fighting than you are at lying, because you are a terrible liar. What? I am... I'm an awesome liar. The deceptive... Uh, deceivers of... Lie our mountain. Set uh, uh, fine. Fine. I thought I was ready for this. Guys, hey, I found something. Get your uh, shirt up. Be right there. Hey, uh, let's uh, just keep amigo. this between you and me, huh, amigo? She's a fan. It's nice. Look, you have no idea how it feels. To have everyone around you think you're some... has been. I don't think Petra needs to hear about it. So... just hush on it. Ah, don't worry, Jack. We all get scared from time to time. Yeah, yeah, I, I guess. Hey. Thanks. I found the next door down there, but it needs that glove thingy of yours. What's keeping you guys? Uh... uh... Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Let's check it out. Let's go. Okay, that is cool. Sure. Let's see how cool you think it is when your life is on the line. That symbol. Inches from the abyss. Ah. I know what I'm talking about, Nerm. Just remember what we talked about, right, Jack? Yeah, right. You're right. He'll live, he'll survive. Yes. Guardians. Couldn't club and groups it in. Guys. Move. Whoa, that was too close. Do you remember any of this, Jack? I... Uh, it's all a blur. It's a test, though, to see whether the adventurer is worthy of the structure block. Yeah. Jack? Is that, uh, Dark Prismarine? Or something like it. What are those things for? And it looks like it's made of glowing obsidian. Okay, we've got guardian fish and floating water blocks. Water? Floating in midair? That should be impossible! <sighs> well, if I know one thing, it's definitely not the admin. <sighs> oh, he won't listen to me anymore. Guys! <sighs> Sorry, Nurm, but I think Jack's right. There's got to be an explanation for this. See? <sighs> well, I don't know about an admin, but I really, really don't like that floating water. Okay, those sponges might just be the thing to soak up the water and leave the Guardians high and dry. Right, so we're gonna use the sponges on the floating water, dry it up, and that should take out the Guardians. Dibs on that job. I think those stupid fish owe me. Okay, but uh, someone's gonna need to run the other way and distract the Guardians, right? Buy you guys time? Wouldn't mind having some backup, whoever isn't doing the running. Okay, I'll run and keep the Guardians off your back. You and Jack do the sponges. Okay, everyone, let's get nuts. Ready. Ready. Then go! Hey, laser lips! Oh, boy. Woo! What's it like being ugly and bad at your job? Made it. Booyah! Oh no. No, no. Jack problem. S Sammy! Jack? Jack! Jesse! We've got a Jack problem! Jesse! Catch! I'm so sorry. Hmm. Oh. Jack, are you okay? I thought you had this. No. 
I'm, I'm not okay. I didn't deserve our awesome cool guy handshake before. Oh. I'm really sorry, everyone. That pile of inventory there? That was my friend, Sammy. Jack. No, I don't need your pity. I don't... I don't deserve it. I need to be alone right now. Whatever is left of Voss must be somewhere down here, too. I don't know about you, but I want out of this room. Structure blocks gotta be close. Glowing obsidian. So strange. Uh, hello! Is someone there? Uh, what? Hello? <laughs> I, I thought I heard someone! Kofu Kale! <laughs> I think if you get the door open, my cage should open too. You know, if you don't mind. Oh, it's so nice to hear another voice after all this time. How'd you get up there, though? Oh, I, I got trapped a long time ago. It's very smelly in here now, and it, I'll say nothing more on the subject. I'll leave you to it. No. Fine. This is going to take a while. Hmm. Hmm. Darn. Quite the structure block, but seems useful. Well, at least this temple was nice enough to provide a crafting table. Prismarine. I was just looking at that door, and I don't think that's what we need here. Maybe try a sea lantern? Oh, right. Here. Oh, wait. I made Prismarine again. That's all right. Here, I made these for you. It is so level. not have the pattern right.
again, and I really don't want to know what happens when that third light comes on. That's gonna take a while to figure out since I don't remember the pattern. I want out of this room. Structure blocks gotta be close. <gasps> wow, that is like an unnatural amount of loot to pop out of one guardian. Let's see what he dropped. Okay, prismarine shards and. Whoa, prismarine crystals! Ha, huh, sweet drop! Those are mega rare! Fine! This temple was nice enough to provide a crafting table. Ooh, prismarine. I was just looking at that door, and I don't think that's what we need here. Maybe try a sea lantern? Oh, right. Wait, I made prismarine again. That's all right. Here, I made these for you. Hmm, dark prismarine. Not quite the structure block, but seems useful. Pattern is. Sea lantern, dark prismarine sea lantern. not have the pattern right. Oh man, not again. And I really don't want to know what happens when that third light comes on. I can fail. I give up. <laughs> 